with Edwan Amagav, who will be uh, fighting on the UFC on Fuel TV 9 card on April 6th in Stockholm, Sweden. Um, Edlan, um, can you describe where you're from originally? Uh, I'm from Russia, Shishan Republic. Okay, and um, you're known for your spectacular striking as well as your very good grappling. Can you describe your background, um, how you started, um, what type of uh, training you've done? Why don't you tell us, because I watched the story of Barbie and Udara Честно сказать, вольной борьбы так, ну, особо нету у меня. А ударных техники, могу сказать, в детстве мы очень много смотрели фильмов про Вандама, Джеки Чана. И вот на шпагате с детства что сажусь, и старшие братья, ну, когда мелкие бывают в школе, в улице, всегда друг с другом дрались. И вот так с детства у меня растяжка осталась, и вот так ногами, походу. But I, the reason I started, I got interested in, in that kind of sport is because I've been watching a lot of movies as a kid, as a ch growing up. So it was really nice for us to watch on TV how mixer, mixed martial arts were ex exposing. But I was doing splits since I was a little kid. So since then, I just got, I got really interested in the sport. And we're seeing more fighters come from Chechnya and Dagestan, you know, training here at Jackson's. Почему вы думаете, что из Дагестана и из Республики Чечня в основном все бойцы сюда приезжают? And what we see with them are that they're very tough and they work very hard. Why do you think that is? И что мы видим? Мы видим в них то, что они постоянно работают сильно над спортом и они они приезжают, концентрируются только на спорте. А, Почему это вы думаете так? Ну, я сперва расскажу, как я попал в Лексус ММА. Я года два назад вообще контракт заключил с Райкфорсом, попал в Америку. Год я тренировался в Нью-Джерси. А у меня дальний знакомый был тогда, сейчас уже очень близкий, хороший друг, Рустам Габилов. А он уже здесь был, тренировался у Джексона. И я вот так на его бой поехал, и через него договорился с Джексоном. И вот так Грег Джексон посмотрел бои, и он согласился. После этого я уже здесь тренируюсь. Один бой под руководством Джексона провел, сейчас второй бой готовлюсь к UFC. А мне очень нравится, хорошие спарринг партнеры, <coughs> ударки там. Карлос Ганди, Джон Джонс, по борьбе Рустам Хабилов, сам тренер Уинкил Джон по ударке, сам Грег Джексон, так что мне все устраивает, я очень доволен. Basically, uh, the reason I picked Jackson's MMA is because two years ago, when I first got here to the United States, I was fighting with the Strike Force. So a year after that, uh, I just needed to find a better, uh, a different gym. So like one of my friends, Rustam Khabilov, which was at Jackson's MMA, told, told me, I was like, why don't you come to Jackson's and we'll, uh, we'll figure it out. We'll talk to coaches, see if they can uh, accept you to Jackson's. So then Adlana Magov came to, the, came to Jackson's. <laughs> he really likes the sparring over here, the sparring part, uh, partners, such as John Bones, Carlos Khan did, and uh, uh, they're really good punchers and hitters. And well, he yeah, also wrestling. for with grappling and wrestling, he really like enjoys sparring with uh, Rustam Khabilov in the, in that particular category, as against the rest of the team. It's like he also loves uh, working with Coach Win, Coach John, Coach Jackson. Brandon Gibson, he loves all those coaches and he thinks they're really good guys. Okay, and can he describe what it's been like training here in Albuquerque at a higher elevation? When you first get here? to Albuquerque, New Mexico. He says that he's really tired, really weak, and he has headaches for a couple of days. 
the reason is because of that sea level elevation. But after a couple of days, after a week, he starts getting back into his regime and starts feeling great and working 100% at it. And um, does he have any thoughts about his upcoming opponent um, in uh, for his fight in Sweden, uh, Chris Spank? I think he's a great fighter. He has great striking skills, kicking. He's like a great boxing. The only weakness I really see in him is uh, he has no wrestling, no uh, no grappling. Yeah, uh, he's like I have like well actually he hasn't seen it. He just uh, haven't seen it on the video, so he's not sure if he has any grappling or wrestling skills. But he said he thinks that it's going to be a great fight. Okay. And does Alan have any other final thoughts or anything else he would like to uh, make a comment on? Ну всех каждого хочу поблагодарить. Они очень тепло к нам относятся. Все советуют, ну то, что надо тренировки там, спарринг, партнеры, все объясняют. Больше как будто мы уже как бы родные. Есть ну благодарность есть в первую очередь. А также, конечно, те, которые в России на Кавказе за нас болеют, им тоже большое спасибо. А все в принципе. Тебе тоже, как смотришь в Алтыкерке. Basically. I want to thank Jackson's MMA and all my, uh, especially the coaches, all the coaches, Greg, Winkle, John, Brandon, all my sparring partners, all my teammates. It was like, uh, you guys accepted us with your guys' hands open. And you guys always advise us what to do and stuff like that. So I feel like being at this gym as if one of the family members, everybody's so close to each other. Also, I want to thank all, all the people back home, all the fans, and everybody who's voting for us and keeping the hopes up. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you, Adlan, and good luck, and uh, I'm sure you'll bring home that win.